we can even see the entire aurora. That's just brilliant. Oh, what's this? What are you? Are you gonna kill me? What are you? Hello. Axelwack here and I'm bringing you another episode of Subnautica. So I decided to just play around without recording and uh, I went to the to the Aurora, I found a way to get inside, I used this, uh, what's this, the proton cannon, sorry, the, the propulsion cannon to move debris out of a doorway and um, fought my way through fire and, and so on, but it seems like there's a bug um, inside the Aurora that basically allows you to see through walls and uh, if you're underneath the water then uh, you, you can see through the walls but you can't get through them kind of thing and I kind of navigated my way through it and I found two prawn suit items um, but then I got to where they call the living quarters and there is no floor um, and not in a way that that's how it was developed it really looks like a glitch or a bug um, you've got items that are seem to that should be standing on that floor level but because there's no floor there it kind of looks like they're just floating in mid-air so there's a bug there and if you walk you literally fall through the floor into the water and then you you can't do anything so i left that and i decided to come to the same island where the sunbeam was actually shot down and just above here there's a little uh, area that you can walk up you find a purple artifact and when you walk right up to this over here it actually opens up this uh there was a, a green force field kind of thing and that's opened up so I thought uh, I'm gonna record this uh, because if something interesting happens then I want you guys to see it so uh, I have saved just before I, I put the artifact in so let's go let's 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 have a look and see uh, that there was a message that said that um, this the internal area of this is filled with alloy and some unpredictable um, I don't know, something about unpredictability, then there was some message that I couldn't read. Um, but I see that they've got a scan item here, so let's, let's scan this this artifact. The artifact terminal. Okay, I'm not going to check that out now. I'm going to leave this on because this you can actually use uh, to pick up um, things. Uh, let's say there's little items here, pick it up and throw it away. Um, I did that at the Aurora. There's some sort of, if you remember when we came in, um, to originally meet the sunbeam here, um, there was that little spider crab weird single eye thing. Um, you can pick those things up and shoot them away. So, all right, let's carry on. Let's 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 see what's going on here. Let's see if we meet some aliens or find some something interesting, maybe. So I haven't been in here before, so the first time I'm seeing it now is the first time you're seeing it as well. And uh, I have no idea what to expect, so let's let's see what's happening. I, I originally thought it was my PC with this jerking and, and kind of frame rate drop thing, but I even dropped my graphics down quite a bit um, from from full HD 1080p to down to 720 same thing and I believe my one friend is getting the same sort of thing so I think it is with anyways it's within the game let's 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 keep going let's see what's what's this green thing analysis of the patterns on the walls cannot ascertain whether their purpose is aesthetic or functional further data required okay let's Let's keep going. What's this? What's this? Data terminal. Click on it. I know language Unit attempting locked. translation. Attempting translation. Integrate new PDA data. <laughs> So I see my buddy talking about the bulbo trees. Um, 
something I, I picked up and I'm sure all of you know, uh, if you use your survival knife and you hit the bulbo trees, it actually gives you quite a bit of water and a little bit of food. Uh, but I'll show you guys after this. Uh, let's just keep going. Let's see what we find. Or don't find. Or need to fight. I'm just glad that there's no aliens yet. Let's see what's this green thing. Let's just make sure there's nothing around here. What is this? Air movement. I think that was this. Let's let's see what this is. What is this? Let's scan it. It wants us to scan. Ion crystal. Take it? Yes. Let's take it. What now? So he checks it out. And then? Normally if you take something like this then things come running at you. Nothing. So alright, let's... I'm hearing some creepy noises here. Let us... What's down here? Okay. I think this is the right way. Let us see, let us see. What, what do we find here? There's another one of those data things. What makes me wonder is, I'm not seeing any life forms here, but something had to happen inside here. Well, there had to be things inside here to allow that, that cannon to shoot down the sunbeam. Okay, here's another one. Let's Hopefully I've got space. Oh, it just takes one block, so that's fine. Alright, let's... Let's take that one as well. Alright, alright. See now, I don't know if that's a glitch or not. But that's sort of the same thing that I had with the Aurora. It looks like something's floating midair. Alright, but well, let's let's just grab this. Let's have a look here. Alright, terminal data. Resistance is fertile. Okay, maybe the aliens like music too. Alright, let's... I'm almost just get to walk in there. Um, I'll show you guys now what I'm referring to. I'm going to be very disappointed if this is a glitch. See, lights go on. But now what? See, this is a problem. Oh, look, I guess it is an early access game, but I'm just afraid that this is going to cause a problem in terms of moving forward in the game, because here is a light, and there's something there, which means, and there's there, which means that there must be a corridor here, and I'm not going to walk here, I know I'm going to fall, um, I know I'm going to, it happened in the Aurora as well, so... Um, alright, well I'm going to report this as a bug and then I'm going to head back, um, hopefully when I come back uh, sometime then I can, hopefully this will be gone, maybe I can walk here then, but let's first see if there's something up top, I'm not going to be able to walk there, I'm not going to, uh, let's see if there's anything higher up, maybe there's a door here, no door, okay, let's keep I see the lights coming on like that. It's kind of cool. Okay, let's... And I'm running around in my little wetsuits. Okay. Let's see, is there only one? Do both ways go up to the same place? Your best probability of interfacing with this facility is, achieve, is achieved by accessing the control room in the lower section, which, by the looks of it, I cannot get to. So that's that's not exactly a good thing. Let's just keep running and let's just see if we can't see anything else. Let's keep going. Okay, it's night time. Um, so 
I'll admit that that is quite disappointing. Um, Alright, while I'm here, I'm going to show you guys what I mean about the Bilbo tree. Uh, it looks like it's sunlight that's actually coming. Maybe I should run back and see, maybe I'm lucky enough and that area is back. Let's see this little butterfly, can we grab it? Bird? No, I can't. Alright, let me show you what I mean about this. So, if I hit this, it gives me Bilbo tree sample. And then what we do is uh, Bulba tree sample will now give us 10 H2O and 3 food. It's pretty good. So we've at least gotten two of these ion crystals. I'm not sure what we can do with it yet. Let's hit two of them. Let's just grab it again. I'm gonna hit it. How many more times can we do it? Okay, I'm full. Okay, I only do two at a time now because let's, let's just keep eating them. Just so that we can fill ourselves up so that we know where. Okay, we should be okay. I'm gonna try and run in there one more time. Um, actually, before I do that, let's I'll show you how um, where I got that artifact. So it was this way up here. And the artifact was actually standing just about here. Right here. Okay, so let's run on this walkway and let's see where does this lead? Does it lead somewhere? Can we go somewhere else? Let's run, let's have a look, let's see if we can't maybe get back there. Um, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to save right here. Uh, so let's save. And I'm actually going to try and run and we see what happens. I'm probably going to fall through the floor, but let's just have a look. And as I, we have an open gap again. Okay, so... Control room by what they said is let's see there's another iron see this is the problem so now okay let's do it check yeah yeah probably gonna fall to my death oh I fell into water okay I to get in. Alright, well that was fun. Um, let's just go to the top and let's see. Do I 
reach the top. Can I reach the top? Funny that there's nothing big down here that's gonna attack me. Am I gonna hit the top of the water? Oxygen. Is there water in front? Alright, so we have water. have glitched so badly that I can see almost right to the bottom. Alright. Hmm. Let's see if I can get up here. Can I? Am I going to be able to? Oh, I can. Wow. Alright. Um, happening now is everything trying to render in. Hmm. Okay, so that just kind of made everything glitch. Are flying basically. Huh? Is this water? Yes, it is. All right. Well, let's. There's some pipes there that make no sense at this point in time. But let's let's explore the the glitched areas. Why not? Let's explore. Buggy bug bug bug. Let's see if there's not open areas that we can. See the entire aurora, that's just brilliant. Oh, what's this? What are you? Are you gonna kill me? What are you? Hello. Okay. That's interesting. Um, so he hit me and then disappeared. First encounter with an alien. Interesting. So if we fly back down, swim. At the moment we're flying. So we're flying at the moment. There you are again. Okay, but... Oh, oh you're busy shooting at me. Gee, that's nice. I did nothing to you. I did nothing but swim into your place. friends with you. Where are you? There you are. Hey, you disappeared. Come on. Silly alien. Right, well, I'm gonna drown, so... Interesting. There's a cave there. Alright, I'll tell you what. Let's, let's explore that cave very quickly. Let's just get some oxygen. And we explore the cave, and we die there. Let's see if that thing of mine is still there. Is 
it? There it is. So that at least didn't glitch away, but now it's also floating in midair. Hmm. I wonder how deep can I see? This doesn't seem to be as scary as uh, is what it is before it glitches. Tell you what, let us do our last, our last dive for this video. Let's get into the semi form. Thank you very much, and let's see how deep we can go. How deep can we go? The max is 200 meters, so let us hit further than that. If we don't hit a Leviathan, that wants to kill us first. Floating rocks. How deep does this go? Alright, we're frozen. I want to see things break first. Come on, man. 180, 90, 200. Whoa. Maximum depth reached. Hull damage imminent. Yeah, yeah, let's see how deep can we go. Okay, this doesn't make sense now. So, how deep does this go? 300. Oh, there's a floor. Oh, what do you know? Oh, there's another hole there. 400. 10%. Can I carry on swimming? Oh, gee, can you believe that? So, so I can go further and be fine. That doesn't make sense to me. See you in the next video. Ciao, ciao.